So hey, it's Harry Husky, or as you may better know me on this channel as Harry Film Stuff. Now, I have made a video of this on my Harry Husky YouTube channel, but I thought I'd make a video for this one, uh, given the fact this shirt has made some appearances um, on uh, some of my past videos over the past few years, mainly of convention videos and whatnot. Um, but I kind of wanted to explain this video why I am parting ways with the shirt, but because I have said what I have said on the Harry Husky YouTube channel, I'll keep it brief for this one. Um, basically, the only reason why I got this shirt was because I actually fell in love with the, the tie-dye design, and I didn't care much about the good vibes only phrase on it. Um, and the only re and it pretty much came to like I actually saw photos of Sonny Dingo wearing it, so I'll just uh, post an example here. So this was the very first picture I saw of him wearing it, and I just fell in love with the design straight away. It had nothing to do with the fact that it had good vibes only written on it. I didn't care for that. I just fell in love with the colours and I fell in love with the stuff with the tie-dye design, but that was literally it. So ever since I got it, I have worn it about at a few places. I have uh, worn it as nightwear in particular, but um, I can't bring myself to wearing this shirt anymore. And I'll explain some reasons why. So one of the reasons being is because of this post which came to light, which highlighted some toxic positivity as it was called and some replacements in favour of what you can say instead of this. Um, one of the things in particular on there was, of course, good vibes only, and I had to look into it a bit more to understand as to why, and apparently it excludes different kinds of vibes, for example, like uh, bad vibes or iffy vibes or um, other forms of vibes that kind of people actually need in their life um, to get that essence or that indication of somebody maybe being a terrible person, but that I can perfectly understand. Um, but that wasn't the main issue as to why I'm not wearing this anymore. Um, the main reason issue is because I've actually had people unfollow me on Twitter and unfriend me on Facebook, and I've even had people who literally do not want to speak to me over the uh, shirts. And the thing is, I, I've had this case where people who I've considered friends and I have made friends with over the past few years um, and people who actually hold, held close to my heart have unfollowed me on Twitter and then proceed to subtweeting uh, certain stuff. And one of the things listed in particular was good vibes only. So I knew that I was one of the people being referenced there. And because of how much this continues, I was kind of put out of the position to continue wearing the shirt. I've made some posts on Twitter saying how I couldn't bring myself. And uh, there was some mixed ones. There were some understandable responses. I even did a poll asking if I should continue wearing it, if I should stop wearing it, and another answer if I should stop promoting toxic positivity. Um, the poll, surprisingly, had most people say yes, carry on wearing it. But it didn't kind of change my mind in a way. And it was because of the events surrounding the shirt and the phrase good vibes on it, and particularly how people feel around it. Um, I am in no position to continue wearing this shirt and as of recording this video this time me being in front of a camera will be the last time you will see me wearing this shirt. I've made the decision not to wear this shirt at events or conventions I go to because um, initially the plan was I want I, I, when I first became a big dog for the first time. I did want this to be the very first tank top I was seen in, and it was actually the very first tank top I wore while it was a big dog. So I do have some history with this shirt, um, but it's just a matter of approaching someone, and even though it's not the intention, but the whole good vibes only thing is shoved in their face, which is not how I intended to come across. I don't know that people are not going to want to speak to me just because of the, not so much because of the shirt, because of what is written on it. So, I know I, I'm, I'm trying to explain things differently to how I sit on the Harry Husky YouTube channel, but I think you might want to watch that video for a better explanation, because I'm trying to keep it as brief as possible. Um, but basically, because of the events surrounding uh, the phrase good vibes only, yeah, so there is no way that I'm going to be seen in the public eye with this shirt on, so you will not be seeing any more photos of me wearing this shirt you will not be seeing any videos of me wearing this shirt anymore and I will not be going anywhere in public wearing this shirt. Um, 
However, I am going to hang on to these shirts just as nightwear, uh, just like something to, to wear to bed or something, or wear while I'm lounging around in the house, but just not out in public places. And um, the shirt itself actually is discontinued, uh, so you can't actually buy this anymore. There, is a, there are a few auto events surrounding this that I did mention the Harry Husky YouTube channel, but I don't want to end up repeating it on here. Um, but uh, yeah, so there is one alternative I did actually find, and that was uh, eBay in this case. So I ended up finding this, uh, which has got no text on the front, and is actually very similar in colour to this. Um, in terms of the title design, the design is quite similar as well, but thankfully no text on the front. So I'm definitely going to be wearing that instead of this at uh, conventions. So I'm, I'm actually, I don't know if you can't see them very well, but I'm actually wearing new sandals and uh, I'm trying to get used to them still so I keep treading on them. But with all that being said, I've said everything I can on the topic and I haven't really done a good job at explaining this as I have on the Harry Husky YouTube channel. So I'd recommend you probably go and check out that one if you want to get a better picture of why I have thought. I think you may have got the picture already, but it's just that I've been very careful to try not to say the same thing in the same way that I did over on that video. But, uh, oh well, so with all that being said, and with this being the one last time I'm going to be wearing this tank top. Uh, but the one idea I did have was me to maybe turning it into a crop top because Sunny Dingo gave me the idea, but um, I'll elaborate more on if that does happen. But thank you so much for watching this video. Uh, take care of yourself and bye bye for now. Mwah.